Hello friends, welcome in the day 9 of the 30 days of code in Hackerland. So today we solve the recursion problem. So let's go to the problem. So here is the task section. So write a function that takes a positive integer n as a parameter and then print the result of n factorial. So you simply write a factorial function and then take an input from user and then call the factorial function and the factorial function return the factorial of the given input number so it is much easier problem so you simply go through the input output and explanation section for better understanding the code so now i go to my hacker rank editor and here all the code are present this is very much code for this little small program so i simply select all the program and then press backspace for deleting or removing this code and simply write a small c program so i write as include stdio.h and then int main and then declare one n variable which take the user input and then you scan f this value from user and then put it into the n variable so done and then you simply call the factorial function so the factorial function and then call it by giving the value of n so i call the factorial function so then i make a factorial function factorial function and then int n and then you simply check if the number is 1 or not because here is the condition if the n is 1 then you simply return it 1 and if it is not 1 then you simply return n into factorial n minus 1 so i simply check if n equal to equal to 1 or not so if n equal to 1 then you simply return 1 so else means it is not 1 so you simply return n into factorial so i think you know about the recursion in recursion the function call itself so inside the else statement you simply call the function factorial so the function call itself this means it is recursion so i simply declare another variable which is fact in the main function and then simply write fact equal to factorial n and then print the fact so fact is the integer then you simply return the fact so i think this is the code for this problem so i simply run the code so here shows that compilation error so what is the error so here is the factorial so you simply write factorial oh. so i mistake in spelling of factorial so f s t t so it is t so i think now it's done so it's processing and it shows that sample test case 0 is passed so you simply press the submit code button to test some additional cases so all the test cases are passed and you simply got the 30 points so this is the day 9 recursion problem it is a simple and small problem i think you understand this problem so if you like my video then press the like button and do not forget to subscribe my channel so this is for day 9 see you in the day 10 thank you friends goodbye